what's up dudes Kublikon here and welcome back to Doc Souls so this is gonna be kind of fun um this is a little bit of a go back and uh, kick ass episode is how I'm describing it enjoy the darkness so beautiful it's gorgeous uh, basically uh, I want to go after that dragon and um, I think that's gonna be pretty fun and uh, as you guys can see we look all sexy with our green halberd and everything it's got the mossy covered it's gorgeous Wonderful. We're back in the undead burg. I actually came back here originally because I thought I could be able to find my way to the next uh, like fighting area, and I was wrong. I don't know exactly where that is, and there's still a couple areas that we can get back to. I also read up on some um, like DLC stuff because this is the Prepare to Die edition, so I could go ahead and do those and things like that. So I'm kind of looking forward to it. But first, we're gonna see if we can take on this Drake. Yep. And you know we're. There we go, getting those free sows. Let's uh, let's give him a hi ho, hi ho, hi ho. You're the Drake I know. Maybe he won't hit me here because I'm safe from his breath. No, I'm not. But I hardly get hurt from it now. Except then I die. <laughs> huh. Well then, um, uh, well, we have a lot of souls we can go up and grab, huh, so I wonder if that Drake is actually expected to be defeated, but I mean, I also don't have any, like, fire protection on my guy right now, like, that, that would be a huge benefit, is having anti-fire, plus, I ha wasn't exactly being very, uh, sneaky or anything. I wonder if I pull out my bow. We run over here. Whoop! Ow! So that fire attack doesn't really hurt us. Boink! A little lower. Boink! We walk down here. Yeah! Go ahead and try, Ugo. Ow! Alright, that one got us. Huh. Is this gonna go back and forth? Can yep, there we go. Ow! Okay. Alright. Gonna. Hmm. Have some sunny D. What do we pull this out on him? Oop. Yeah. Yeah. Ow. Okay. Um. Ow. Okay. All right. <laughs> oh. Uh, Sunny D, maybe instant Sunny D. Nope. All right. That's a lot of death. Yeah, he might not be somebody that we're able to take on that's necessarily. Um, I think it's worth a, you know another try. Plus, we also have that uh, that one Dark Knight that I fought so many times and kept dying against. Uh, we have to pay him that a visit again too. But uh, right now, it's like I feel like I'm just learning how to fight this dude, so I'm not too worried about it. You know, Dark Souls and death is kind of a thing that happens all the time. Look at that sex face. Just filled with death. Alright, over here. So, we I know we can run past him. Alright, so we're pulling this out. Attack! Are we hurting him? Ow! Can't really tell. Roll! Oh, wow, I'm very dead. Hmm. I don't get it. Sometimes it's like I get hit and I can take a bunch more attacks. Other times I get hit and I'm pretty much dead instantaneously. Hmm. I'm wondering what the trick would be. Hmm. So what do you guys think of the, uh, the giant stone armor? It's, uh, moving around in it is pretty fun, for sure. 
Uh, but I do, I am beginning to feel slow, and I was doing some googling, and I saw that there's a lot of, um, other pretty quality armors. You're not gonna, you gonna fire them? There we go. Ow! Crap. I was gonna try to get the, my green right there. Alright. Maybe I have, like, anti-fire something. Hmm. Man, I gotta really try some of this stuff, too. Some of these large titanite chunks, or shards or whatnot. I mean, we have weapons that we could upgrade. I stabbed him. Oh, he is angry. Drink the Sunny D. Whoop, over here now. Shield up. Oh, the shield helped. That's cool. Sunny D. Shield up. Up. Oh, we lost those souls. Well, it's not too bad. Six thousand's easy for us to get now. Hmm. I'm uh, I'm unsure if this guy's really defeatable. So instead, we're gonna play this a little differently. We're gonna just try to get past his butt. And when we get past his butt, we get ourselves a new little bonfire and we also get ourselves to fight that freaking knight so that'll be pretty sweet and if any of you guys know actually what happens let me know what happens if you actually defeat that dude i uh, i don't know uh, just for that there we go all right here we go so what we do to get past him is we let him know that we don't like any of his shit and the way we let him know that is we give him a little little love tap and then he gets up into the air and starts flying around well we go oh here he's already coming run 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 slash how much damage did that cause him hold on 127 shield up come on Whoop. That was a sweet dodge. I feel proud of that. Ow. That was less sweet. Okay. I know I said I was just going to run past him, but now I'm really curious what we can do to him. Under your feet! Ow. Fuck. Huh. So, depending on how high he jumps in the air. How high, how high he jumps in the air. That's definitely a thing that happens. Alright. Alright. I'm going to stop playing around. We're going to go for it this time. Straight through his legs. We're going to make it all the way to the other end. He's going to leave, and that's okay. That will be the Dark Souls experience, because I want to take out that Dark Knight more. Because the Dark Knight, I know for a fact, is uh, someone worth fighting. I'm going to get some of those. Nice. Ah! Shield! Man, I love to see that that shield actually is able to protect us a bit. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. I'm, uh. I got too zealous. <laughs> uh, okay. Damn. He's just making this difficult. Jeez. Oh, well, at least we're getting 500 souls every time. We'll get those 6,000 souls back in no time. Anyway, how do you guys like this ladder? We've been here a couple times, haven't we? It's so beautiful of a ladder. It's so tall and climby. It's great. Also, the reason I have the halberd out versus the uchi katana is a very simple reason. Uh, the halberd has more, um, like, I'm trying to think of the word, uh, like, it can take more damage than the uchi katana thingy. Here we go, here we go. Run it through his legs! Picking shit up as we go. Picking shit up as we go. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah! You can't stop us. We're in here now. So good. Look, look, I'm gonna pull the lever. Whoop. Ow. Oh! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh oh. He's on the roof now. Is he gone? Yeah, he's on his way out. See ya, sucker! 
Arrow! Oh, I missed. Arrow! Can you imagine if that hit him and he like just comes back? I wonder where he goes. Goodbye, friend. You were a hell of a person in the beginning. Really scary, and then I kind of fight you, and then you just off. I wonder if we fight him later. That would be wonderful if we did. But hey, check it. We got sexy lady with baby thing. Boop. It's, uh, it's time to take this opportunity to use a double humanity. Bring back our happy smiling face. As well, oh wow, look at all these massive souls we got here. Oh wow, we have 13 humanity? That's really cool. I didn't know we had so much. Oh man, it's uh... Now we can reverse our hollowing, we can kindle this thing. Nice. Oh, feels good, feels good. And now we can go after that freaking Black Knight dude. Also, this bonfire is really good for actually um, uh, farming humanity. Because the uh, those annoying rats are nearby. But they're actually not here. Check these guys out too. They're just hanging out. Not hurting anybody. Just doing their own thing. And then there's this. Looks really cool. Praise the sun. Uh, nah, all right. They don't do anything. They're just hanging out. There isn't anything really secret here. Or anything like that. I've bashed plenty of things to try to find out. This person said dead end? What an asshole. <laughs> yeah, there's just not much going on. It's just that. Just a little, little hanging out, doing their things. Yeah, we'll repair these. We'll repair these back. There we go. So I'm not going to wear this stone giant armor forever, I don't think. Um, it's just a little, a little much. There we go. Dude, how cool is that? We're taking people out with a single stab. Oh, man. I'm so excited to finally meet this guy again. We're going to take the Uchi Katana out again. Man, we are built, too. Look at that. That looks so good. Oh. If I die again, I'm going to be very disappointed. It might happen. I'm sitting up straight. and I'm getting ready. Oh, it's you and me. It's me and you. No matter how you toss the dice. Damn it. Whoa! Wow, that was all who hurts me now. It's what we'll do. This only one for me is you. Ow, is you for me. So happy together. Yep. The armor makes this ridiculous. I can't see me love nobody. Titanite chunk. And 800 souls. <sighs> I'm kind of disappointed, actually. That was the equivalent of, like... Have you seen the Futurama where Zoidberg goes back to his home planet? And um, when he ba he's at his home planet because it's like this big mating thing. And he finds his old scuttling grounds, which is basically where he grew up as a baby crab. And uh, when he's there, he mentions he sees his old bully who's there. Oh, wow, look at everybody. Hi, guys. Well, let's see what... Uh, we got a new sword, too. Um, it was a, a Claymore. 103... We could use it, 16 strength. And uh, comparing it to um, our halberd, it has massive damage reductions, which is pretty cool. See, 40, 10, 30, 30, versus uh, 60, 10, 40, 40, 38. This is pretty cool. It might be less damage, though, like uh, in the long run. But hold on, let's, uh, let's pull this guy out. That looks pretty cool. I mean, we are kind of being a strength player now. Oh, that's a sweet little, like, little spin he does with it. Put two hands down. Oh, wow. Oh, roll. <laughs> I like it. I like it. I might, uh... You know, we have plenty of souls. We only need about 3,000 or 7,000 in order to be able to fully upgrade a new weapon. This might be our, uh... Instead of the halberd, we can play with something like this. It's not really working right now, though. <laughs> not really getting through their shields very well. I'm still learning this weapon. Hmm. Two hands. Oop. Oh, I missed. Ow. Ow. There we go. It's not bad, though. I'd like to see what it would look like fully leveled up. I'll, uh... Next time, you guys get to see what a fully leveled up Claymore looks like. 
And I'm missing my dude. Come on. Come. <sighs> Maybe he needs a little bit of a kick. <laughs> How was my kick? Was it a good kick? Yeah! Alright, there we go, dude. So, uh, if you liked what you saw, please leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. And of course, may the ground rise to meet your feet. May the windows be at your back. And may the sun shine warmly in your sexy, sexy face. See you later, dudes. It's always a pleasure to have you back. Bye!